he's gorgeous. Now you can see the difference in his, his ivory there. He's definitely left tusked. I have seen this elephant before, but it's been quite some time. And you can see those that tusk, I'd say, what do you think, 30 centimeters circumference? Mm. So that's going to thicken up quite a lot in the next sort of 10 years or so. Uh, re he's already got nice ivory, but I'd say by the time he hits... Oh, a bit of worn bushwalk, he's heading straight towards them. By the time he's about 50, I would say he's probably going to get to 45, 50 centimeters. Herbie, Herbie. So you can see Bushwalk just over there, you can see Vim's antenna. Uh, that big must ball is coming straight for you. Okay. Well, let's stay with him a bit longer. So he's heading directly towards Bushwalk, but I'm predicting he's going to stop at that marula tree there on his way. I'm just waiting for that sun. Get ready for the screen shots. As that sun bursts out, we're going to have the most spectacular views of this Ellie. Yes, but stop at the tree. I don't want to have to give you a, a lesson about behavior now. You're old enough to know better. Oh, it looks like all the marula's off. Oh, it's a male marula, this one, that we're driving past, so no marula fruit there. So he's going to head to the next female. Now, Mary is wondering how fast can an elephant run? Mary, much faster than I can. Or James, for that matter. Oh, what was that, Brian? I don't know, something's making a noise down there. Um, they can do about 55 kilometers an hour. Uh, so much, much faster than Usain Bolt. And they can sustain it for quite a long time as well. Now you've always got to be a little bit cautious with elephant bulls and must as they are in a heightened state of hormones. There's a lot of testosterone and whatnot flowing through. So, ooh, is he going to chase the Inyala? I think there's an Inyala bull there. And yes, I think the Inyala knows that he's in must, so the Inyala is gapping it. Look, it looks like he is wanting to chase the Inyala. That big grey bottom, isn't it wonderful?